All right, I'm going to very quickly review the angle addition postulate. So we have this large angle ABC. So the measure of angle ABC is by adding the measures of angle ABD plus the measure of angle DDC. Well, so you add the two small angles together, it gives you the large angle. Or you can rewrite this to find one of the smaller. So the measure of ABC minus the measure of ABD will give me the measure of DBC. Or the measure of ABC minus the measure of DBC will give me the measure of angle ABD. So this is your main one. So the sum of the two smaller angles equals the larger angle. So we're going to use this postulate to find some missing values. So we're going to solve for the measure of angle ABC. All right, so we're given, and this is not to scale, so, all right, this is just an example. So I'm given the measure of ABD is 7 degrees, and the measure of DBC is 18 degrees. So the measure of the large angle, ABC, is 70 degrees plus 18 degrees, which is... 88 degrees. All right, so that's how you find the big angle. Now, Find the measure of angle A, B, D, and we're given the measure of angle A, B, C is 76 degrees. All right, so we're given the big angle A, B, C is 76. So this whole thing here is 76 degrees, and we're given the small angle. DBC is 25. So the measure of angle ABD is 76 degrees minus 25 degrees, which is going to equal 51 degrees. So the measure of ABD is 51 degrees. All right. Let's just throw one in where we're going to solve for x. Given the measure of A, B, C is 110 degrees. All right. So given A, B, C. 110, and this is 2x plus 2, and this is 3x plus 8. All right, so we don't really know these angles, but we're going to solve for x. So we know that the two small angles add together to give us the larger angle. So 3x plus 8. Plus 2x plus 2 equals 110 degrees. All right, these are on the same side, so we're going to combine like terms. So we're going to add 3x and 2x to give us 5x. We're going to add 8 and 2 to give us 10. All right, we're solving for x, so we're going to subtract the 10. So 5x is 100, and then we're going to divide by the 5. So x is going to be... 20 degrees. And then if I wanted to, you could find the angles of ABD and DBC 
by plugging in the 20 for the x. All right, just a quick review.